episode welcome back to my channel if you're new here my name is Tania and i make college beauty and lifestyle content you might as well subscribe to me i love your girl in today's video i think this is episode 13 of my hbcu vlog series i'm about to get ready for class right now i just woke up just sitting here chilling but i actually need to get a move on because i don't have much time to get ready um since I struggled a little bit getting up, this is the first day back from spring break. I went home for spring break. If you don't follow me on TikTok or at least watch my YouTube shorts or Instagram, you probably have not seen my um, spring break. But I kind of recorded like some short form content during that time. So make sure y'all head over there and go watch that. Uh, but I'm back. This is my first day. I got back Saturday night. Today is Monday, but this is my first day going back to class. So I struggled a little bit getting up this morning but it'll be fine i'll probably just take a little nap later wanted to come on here and show my face though and i do an outfit check right before i leave the house okay home girls i'm finally done getting dressed i just had maria zip me up because i can't get into this without somebody zipping it up so good thing she is awake and getting ready for her class because i have class first so i usually leave out first um on these days but it's currently 18 y'all have to head out the door but i do want to show y'all what i have on today and it's worth being late okay so I put wear this necklace. Y'all showed me wear this um, in the last vlog when I had that uh, burgundy shirt with the skirt and the boots. Y'all probably don't remember, but I remember my looks like the back of my hand, okay? So this is it. Um, I love these braids so much. I don't think I ever recorded a vlog when I get these, but I used to get these all the time, especially like in high school, please. This was my look, okay? These are the nails. I like to do nail checks with y'all now. Y'all know I'm gonna press on girl. And again, this is the outfit though. It's a cute little, um, what, what is this called? Like a jumpsuit that I got for Pretty Little Thing and then these are my shoes. And I'm gonna just carry my um, tote bag that I carry my books and iPad in when I go to class because I just have one class. Let's make it quick. And I'll probably, um, yeah, I don't know. I was gonna say I'll probably stay on campus because I do have two assignments that I wanna get done, but I might come back just considering that I do need a nap and I do want to make breakfast so I need to head out now though y'all so um let's go get this one class out the way and see where the rest of the day takes us just put the beauty parlor in my guest house we mean the pink Lamborghini that's at the next house fuck them so good I got them walking with this chest out I wish these bitches wanted more talent and less clout Make it sick, get hard, soon as I brush up, but we tryna be side dog. Whole city go up when a bitch touch down, like the niggas in the high dog. I put these bitches on gang, they should be kissing my feet. I tried to give them some press, they tried to say it was big. Cause they go to my hood, they know my body is good. Two million dollars to party inside of your baby. Okay, I'm back from class. Class was good. Um, I had my statistics class. I don't know if I mentioned that earlier, but it was good. It only be, um... No, let me restart. I'm back from class. I actually been back for a minute. I had to record a little clip for my TikTok that I'm making. Um, Y'all will see it when it's posted, which will probably be before this vlog goes up. No, that's not true. Yeah, it'll be posted before this vlog. Yeah, for sure. Um, I just made me some breakfast, some oatmeal, and some turkey bacon. Yes, I put my turkey bacon in the same bowl as my oatmeal because... I'm not washing all of dishes i just don't even feel like it so yeah i'm waiting for that to kind of like steep a little bit oatmeal be a little watery at first it'd be like hold on nah did i mess up but i don't think i did i'm just gonna let it sit for a second let that do its thing over there while i do my thing over here okay um class was good we learned something and we always learn something new every class he's been moving at a fast pace and i don't know if i could keep up but i got to um so yeah i was taking my notes i actually didn't put i took my tote bag that i used for class i ended up taking it home as like a personal item on the plane so i can put my ipad and my camera in it when i went home so i forgot to put my pens back in there i put my um like my notebook and my ipad in there but i forgot to put something to write with so i ended up taking notes on my ipad which i don't love to do i only like to use my ipad for like content purposes or just stuff that i'm doing on my own like to-do lists and stuff like that i don't usually use my ipad in class um for writing purposes but that's just because i just prefer to write like the traditional way 
Anywho, I end up writing um, my notes in my iPad because I forgot my notebook. Um, and we learned something new today. I was expecting him to pick up where we left off before spring break, but we on a whole other chapter in that child. So let's just keep the ball rolling. Um, but yeah, so we did that. We did like three examples. I got two of them right. That one in the middle, I got lost somewhere, okay? Um, but I plan later this week to kind of like go over that just so that I don't fall behind, even though I think I got it because I end up getting the example right after after the one I got wrong, if that makes sense. Like I got it right, then I got it wrong, then I got it right again. So I feel like I just uh, made like a math mistake on the other one. It'll be what it be, but I'm actually really tired. So I'm about to eat this really quick. I actually made two packs of oatmeal in that because that's my business now. Nah. Um, but I made two packs of oatmeal and then some turkey bacon. And then I'm about to take a nap. I'm gonna just lay in the bed and watch Death Browse Wives until it's watching me um and get out of this jumpsuit i love this jumpsuit so much this is actually my second time wearing it the first time i wore it was geo's birthday but i didn't end up vlogging that that was at home during christmas break yeah um but yeah child, i'm ready to get up out of this and just get into some comfy clothes and get in the bed i still do have to complete two assignments but they're not um like anything that's like too hard so i'll do it when i wake up it's currently um 10 54 like so it's not even 11 a.m yet so i do have time to eat breakfast and maybe squeeze in a nap before i have to really like do my work um so yeah we'll talk a little bit after the nap homegirls because I haven't checked in I think the last time I checked in was before my nap but I did show y'all me complete my assignments I was able to get them both done that was for my asynchronous class it is a uh, sociological theory we have like discussion posts to complete each week it'll be like one or two but it was two this week um but I got them out the way so I'm glad that's done then I ran to the store real quick I didn't take y'all with me because it was really like a quick run I had to get like some chips and like just little snacks and stuff because I do work tomorrow and then I also work the day after that, which y'all will hear me probably mention. But, yeah, with me working, it's like, I, I know I'm going to want some snacks. Like, once I get off, because I'll be getting off pretty late. Anywho, I'm sitting here about to um, do another entry in my journal, because I didn't get to check in this morning. I was running kind of late. This is my journal. Um, I don't know if I mentioned before, but, like, quick fact about this journal. I got this journal um, when I was in eighth grade. I remember my um, teacher, I used to be locked in, well, still to this day, I'm still locked in with my professors, but like I'm saying, once I, when I was in high school and like um, elementary school, grammar school, whatever, like I used to be locked in with them. Like all my teachers loved me. Um, so my teacher, this specific one, huh, oh my God, I put that in there. My birth, uh, birth certificate just fell out of my uh, journal. Anyway, uh, my teacher gave me this when I was going to high school. She would, and she put like on the first page. And I'm not gonna read it, but like, well, I just won't read the whole thing. But she put like an entry in there that she wanted me to like have when she gave this to me. And I, this is a custom journal, okay? Let me show y'all. This is custom, okay? She got my name in here. Like this is my name and my last initial. She stamped this one. But it basically just says, I need you to know how amazing you are. You are an exceptional child, gifted academically and socially. I cannot be more excited for you, and I know what great things are here for you. Um, the road to success will not be easy. There will be doubt, fear, and the pressures of life. I am certain that you will face these challenges with ambition and grace. To me, I became a teacher because I was called to embrace and empower my community. It, it is my divine duty. I want you to think about how much we need you to do the same. Whatever you choose to do in life, I want you to ask these questions. Am I happy? Am I healthy? Am I helping? Am I honoring? If any of this is a no, don't be afraid to keep it moving in the pursuit of success. Remember that you are loved and that I am your biggest fan. I love you and I love you like you are my own. If you need anything, call and then she put her number and then say I love you. 
when life gets tough right that's what it says on the second page and then from there like i start putting my own journal entries it's um first of all she snapped she did a big one with that i actually haven't read that like in a long time so yeah shout out to her uh, i don't think this is her number anymore but i probably need to shoot her a text or find her on facebook or something um, because I'm sure she would want to know how I'm doing and be like really proud that I'm like in college now. I've talked to her like since I've graduated, but, um, it's been years. So I need to keep in contact. Okay. Um, but my first entry in here, <laughs> I, I told myself once I got to high school, I was going to start writing. So, um, that was like, you know, you get out of school in like June. So I probably graduated eighth grade in like June or whatever year that was 2017. And so my first entry is me in high school. It say Tuesday, September 19th, I think. It's hard for me to read this because for one, my, my handwriting back then was a lot different than my handwriting now. Not too different because it's still big as hell, but it was a little sloppier. And then her handwriting, it was hard to read only because she wrote in cursive. Y'all yeah, know they didn't took cursive out of the academics now. Nah. Anyway, um, but yeah, it, my first entry was September 2017. But when I used to, when I used to write this, I used to be messy. <laughs> like I'm not even gonna read it. This was my other era, y'all. Y'all don't know nothing about this era. Like I'm writing it here messy as hell. But in my entries, like after that, once I start, you know, I found it again. Like I wrote two entries, it say, yeah, two entries in 2017, and then I did not touch this journal again until 2022. So it's me basically saying like, hey, I found this journal again. Woo -woo like yeah and so i guess i started writing again in it at the beginning of college but that's crazy to me that she gave me this journal at the end of my eighth grade year which was the beginning of high school and i didn't really lock back into this until um until i was in college was that my freshman year of college y'all yeah, my memory i think that was freshman year please don't call me to it i might have started college in 2021 i don't remember but anywho I just um, wanted to share that with y'all. So y'all need to get y'all a journal and just start writing in it. Even if you can't do every day. Because I can't even always do every day. I'm not going to lie. But it is occasionally good. So, you know, check in with yourself. Because I do mention all the time. Like, I feel like these vlogs are like my journals. My digital journal. But it still is important to actually put some time into writing down your thoughts. And it don't have to always be like, hey, I did this today. I'm doing this today. It doesn't have to be like so structured in that way but it can be more so like sometimes i just write like hey right now my goal is really to do content i want to you know grow in this way or right now i'm kind of feeling like you know you might mention just stuff that you might be struggling with at that moment or stuff you want to do better from a, a year from now where you might want to be kind of to reflect so i haven't checked in since my last entry was march 6th and today is the 18th but I, I didn't write over break i don't even i don't think i even took the journal with me when i went home for spring break um but now that i'm back i do want to make it you know a priority to journal in so i'm just sitting here then i got my big old kombucha I'm not gonna drink this whole thing usually one of these will last me at least three days maybe four like i'll probably drink it to about right here and then tomorrow i'll drink it to about right there but i'm about to drink this because i forgot to drink it this morning um and I heard it's good to either have it um, first thing in the morning or first thing before bed or last thing before bed. So, yeah. Um, about to do that. And then I still got my messy TV on in the back. I'm watching the Married to Medicine reunion. Yep. Because um, I know my uh, mom, she was texting about it earlier. My family chat, we need to be talking about these shows. So, I got to watch this today because I'm not going to have time to watch it tomorrow. Um, so, I'm trying to catch up on my shows really quickly do this journal entry and then I need to prep my outfit for tomorrow because I told y'all I'm recording like um, my weekly outfits this week for TikTok so I want to make sure I actually put some um, thought into it even though like usually I always prepare my outfit the night before whether I'm recording content or not because I feel like that's one less thing to worry about in the morning and on the days where I prep my outfit the night before I usually do have time to do stuff like journal before class on the days I don't I notice that that's when I'm usually crunch for time. So, yep. So, I'm going to get up. Um, I'm setting up for tonight just for so I can have a smooth day tomorrow. Because, yeah, we're going to go to breakfast in the morning. And I'll basically talk to y'all in the morning. It's only 9.21, so about 9.30. So, I'm going to be up 
for a few more hours. I try to be in bed by like 11. Well, not in bed. I could be in bed by 6, baby. I'm talking about I try to be asleep by like 11, 12. But I have been about an hour back since I just came from home. And the time difference is about an hour, an hour earlier at home. So lately I've been falling asleep around like 1. But that's fine too. Um, but yeah, talk to y'all in the morning. so today is tuesday it's the next day um i closed the vlog out last night i remember when we last left off but went to class this morning um i had social psychology in that class today we just kind of went over our midterm grades because this is the first week back after midterm and after midterm it's clearly the middle of the semester so it's um like usually around this time like teachers will try to like um see where everybody is at and kind of like evaluate how the rest of the semester is going to go based on what your grade might be for now what you might need to do any like extra efforts you might need to do extra assignments and stuff so we talked about that i'm actually going to go to like her office tomorrow after my statistics class um i should have time but i'm going to see um what time she's going to get to her office because I kind of wanted to go over a couple things with these assignments that we have done. But I like that she pushed back one of our assignments that's due this week. She pushed it back. Like, my professor for that class is really, like, I'm not going to say lenient. Because clearly if we have to keep making changes to the assignment, that clearly her standards is where it is. And we don't have to meet her there. But I do like that she gives you time to try over again and again and again until... Um, it's where she feels like it needs to be. So I had that class today. It wasn't really like class form. It was kind of like one-on-one -on -one meetings. And then right after that, I went to my theories of personality class. And I mentioned like a couple vlogs ago, maybe it was at the beginning of the semester. I'm not sure. But in that class, so theories of personality kind of focuses on how you became you and like how people become them so a lot of stuff that we go over in that class is like it'll be a certain theorist like say for instance Sigmund Freud I'm not sure if y'all familiar with him but he's like really popular in the field of psychology but it'll be like a theorist and like how they might believe that at age four your personality is set or age nine or whatever I think it's age four I don't even remember my own uh content <laughs> that I learned in class but no I'm pretty sure it was age four but like just subs like that or like he might believe that your unconscious desires motivate you like whether that's stuff you might dream about just stuff like that just kind of like factors that make you how you are today whether it's stuff that you know you might have been exposed to growing up um failed relationships you might have observed how that affects your relationships with others now and things like that so that's part of what we cover and so for our final project, it's not really like a project, but you do have to get in front of the class. Everybody does. They said the max is five minutes that you can speak. It's like between three to five minutes. And you have to get up there and kind of just tell about yourself. And some people were sharing, you know, things that might have been traumatic, you know, got emotional for a lot of people. Um, but you don't have to get up there and say like, oh, my life sucked so bad. Like, and that's why I am the person I am today. You don't really have to do that. It's more so like you get up there and kind of talk about the life lessons you've learned or stuff that might have shaped you and stuff like that. So it was pretty interesting. Um, I didn't go today because I wasn't prepared to go today. Like I just wasn't in the, I don't know. It's like I've always throughout my life been a talkative person. That's why I can pick up this camera and just talk to y'all knowing that this video could get 100 views or it could get 100 million views. Like who knows when you're putting stuff out here on the internet like how many people will actually have access to it you know what i mean so i've always been the type of person that don't mind sharing like i don't mind to talk i can talk about myself for days i can talk about a lot of stuff for days but at the same time i'm in like a season of my life i think i've been in this season for like the past year or so where i'm kind of over over sharing i feel like i've been an over sharer a lot of my life and it hasn't really like backfired on me in no kind of ways but it's just been to a point where i just you know life has just kind of made me a lot more quiet now i kind of like um want to keep a lot of stuff 
you know, to myself. And it's like I do pick up the camera and share my life in this kind of way. And I share my life on Instagram. But I'm selective about the parts of my life that I share. Like, I don't have to get on here and go into depth about stuff that I feel like I don't, you know, necessarily want to share. You don't. That's the thing with, like, a lot of stuff family friends whatever you don't have to share nothing that you don't want to share and it's not like you don't want to share it because it's negative it's just i just like to keep some stuff for me and i feel like everybody likes to keep some stuff for them to a certain extent you know some stuff is so good that you don't even want other opinions or other eyes on so that's why i was kind of like hesitant to share today in next class uh we're not gonna have class because thursday is the next time we will have it and it's founders day clark atlanta founders day is on thursday um, so yeah, so we won't um, have class that day. So next week I'll probably share. I'll see how I'm feeling. But I think I should be able to share. Like I'm not nervous at all. It's not like a shy thing or like a not wanting to be judged thing because I don't really care about how I'm perceived when I'm the one offering up the information. You get what I mean? Because it's like I'm telling you my story. And so however you perceive that is really your business. That's not really my business. But at the same time, I was just hesitant because I know myself and I can get up there and kind of ramble kind of like how I'm doing now and I just wanted to you know kind of be more selective and careful about the stuff that I said or shared but as of right now I, I kind of did show y'all what I have on today I kind of look cute so this is my choker I wore this choker on Valentine's Day y'all seen that in that vlog I just did a little blush today because I didn't really feel like doing much to my face plus I have work later and I'm not going to work with no full beat unless I really want to okay uh, my braids of course um, I showed y'all the choker. Um, look at these nails. I'm sorry, y'all. I just love my nails so much. Because I haven't had no colored nails in a while. I've been having like French tips and black nails and stuff like that. Cute little jacket from Pretty Little Thing. Cute little, like, I guess, bralette crop. These cargo pants. And my furry shoes. This is my purse. My boyfriend gave this to me like the year before last on my birthday. This morning purse. And these sunglasses actually about to uh, do some content that's why i set up my ring light this is my roommate ring light the ring light girls okay but i just set up my ring light right here because i'm about to um record another clip for my uh tiktok that i'm making and then i'm about to eat lunch i'm gonna come on here and eat lunch with y'all um so we can kind of like talk about the rest of the day or like how the rest of the week is gonna go because i do know i have work later and i won't be able to come on here and share as much but i want to make sure that i'm still you know prioritizing the vlog even though it's other stuff going on because this is a priority to me obviously <laughs> okay so i went and i recorded my content y'all it looks good i look good let me show y'all with the glasses on it eats i haven't even been wearing glasses lately because i mean it was winter and it was like kind of cold and rainy and cloudy it didn't give wear sunglasses but today the first day of spring so the sunglasses is popping back outside the coat is getting put up and we is outside that's just how i feel okay but i just warmed up my dumplings let me show y'all i'm gonna turn on the light i still don't know these light switches and i've been living here for forever <laughs> i just flick them all until they come on but okay let's get set up let's get ready I'm so hungry like I felt myself kind of getting like a little attitude earlier because I was hungry I'm like oh I gotta go home but okay so let me show y'all what I got going this can be a lot taller mm -hmm. we got my yummy dumplings they come in like I'm, I'm not let me show y'all the box y'all been seeing these everywhere I don't know if y'all can hear that. My roommate got music playing. But I got these steamed dumplings. I got them from Publix, but when I'm at home, we get them from Jewels, Walmart. Really don't matter. Wherever sell them, that's where I'm going to be. Oh, these be so good. Oh, I'm so hungry. Didn't it smell? Let me put the sauces on there. Hold on. I got soy sauce, and then I got red pepper. Uh, what's it called? Crushed red pepper. I ain't going to put that much soy sauce. This is low-sodium soy sauce, I think, but... So the soy sauce be salty as hell. And then I'm gonna add this little. Okay. Hold on, let me get my stuff out for my drink. Okay, so my little drink combo right now. I have two drink combos. I'm gonna show y'all the other one probably tomorrow because I'm not gonna drink that right now. But for now, this uh mocha coffee from what the hell is this? International Delight. That, but this is the real part of it. 
this cookie dough Cho Chi Chobani creamer. Oh, I'm tripping over all my words. But this cookie dough Chobani creamer. I feel like the chocolate with the cookie dough, it just tastes like a chocolate cookie. So I'm gonna pour that up and then I have my dumplings. It seems like my stomach finna be whistling and crying. But it should be good. These uh dumplings. I might eat a couple of my chips. But we'll see. I'll probably be pretty full after this. And once I um have this, I'm gonna really just lay down and watch TV until it's time for me to start getting ready for work. Y'all know how I be with caffeine, so let me not pour it too heavy. That seemed like enough. Y'all know how to get. So let me just pour. I don't know how much creamer. I don't want to pour too much, but that's probably enough creamer. Let's try it a little. 10 out of 10. I finished eating my little lunch and then I had my little downtime while I was watching my show. But now, unfortunately, I have to leave out for work, so I'm about to leave out now. I just have to talk to y'all in the morning because I already know once I get in, I'm not going to have time to check in. It'll be like 11 and I need to shower and get ready for the next day. That's my boyfriend on the phone, so don't mind his little loud background. Anyway, I'll talk to y'all tomorrow. Today is Wednesday and it's the next day. Um, it's currently around like 8 a.m. I need to be leaving out for class, but I wanted to come on here and kind of just tell y'all the plan for today. For starters, I woke up feeling like really congested and my eyes feel really weird, but I think that's because I was rubbing them yesterday. My allergies have been acting up. And then my nose was probably congested like this because I slept with the window open. But come on now, yesterday was the first day of spring. I'm thinking I could sleep with the window cracked without getting sick. Excuse me. But it's okay. I'm going to still push and get through the day. Um, so I have statistics this morning. I'm about to go there and take my notes or whatever we have to do with class today. And then I mentioned yesterday that my social psychology teacher, um, professor, was um, going to be in her office all day today just making sure that everybody um, assignments is up to par. I kind of want to go there just to make sure because I really feel like leading up to midterm your grade is supposed to be in a really good space so that afterwards all you're doing is maintaining for those next couple weeks because after March and maybe like the first or second week of April the semester is pretty much over and you're really not going to be covering stuff that's too hard you know it really would be stuff that's kind of reviewing for the final so i feel like uh, my grade in her class is not in the space that i would have wanted it uh, previous uh prior to midterm but a couple of the assignments are not put in yet because she wants to make sure that we have done them right before we even like before she even grades them so i'm gonna start out her class today her office today because i just want to make sure that i'm in good shape to continue on for the rest of the week i mean for the rest of the semester um, so I'm stopped by there. I have to drop uh, this shirt off to somebody on campus. And then what is something else I need to do? Oh, I was supposed to have work today, but when I was at work yesterday, one of my coworkers was like asking me, um, she said she needed a few more hours. She was asking if she could take my shift. I'm like, girl, yes, you can, because I do have some stuff I need to get done. And I really want to make sure that school is always a priority and that I'm making sure everything is taken care of that I need to. Um, what else? Yeah, so when I, once I go to my professor today, I'm sure she'll give me, like, some critiques on what to fix. I'll come back, fix that, and then just start getting everything else that I need to get done. I got to really look at everything that exactly, yeah. And I'm going to review my statistics material that I get today. I can take that work off because I don't have that today. That's pretty much the plan for today. Making sure that I'm getting all my academic stuff out the way while I have the day off. And pretty much just kind of plan clean up for my social psychology class. I have to leave out now. I just have on some athleisure outfit. This uh, jacket, leggings, and then I put on my new balances with some socks. Don't matter my garbage. Um, but I need to leave out now. My nose is so congested, y'all. So I'm just praying I can get through the day without feeling like too tired. Because I am sleepy too. Because I got in late. And then I had to shower. So... I'm just not feeling that well. I'm running on like maybe four and a half hours of sleep. Um, so I'll probably squeeze in a nap somewhere in the day. But other than that, I'm leaving out now. Talk to y'all later.
I have my ticket out for most. Shout out sushi, sweet and keep me rolling. But if we get the up, we gotta slow. Riding around with Drake, like we have yo. I got some gas and I want some more. Still got a pass in the hood, call it give and go. Keep a nigga, man, bitch in a fit of folk. Let me fuck when I want, I just come and go. Man, it's getting too deep for these skin and clothes. I might put me in. Okay, y'all, so I kind of wanted to recap, like, this morning. It's a little piece of my lash that's hanging, so that's kind of a bother in my eye. But um, I went to recap this morning, so I had my statistics class. I went in there, and we went over something new again. I like, every day we're in there, we're going over a new... <laughs> it's a new chapter every day. Maria's like, y'all, come out the room. I took my down for whatever. I come out the room. Look at Maria. She's just sitting here all productive. <laughs> So much to get You're gonna have to tell them about it. Oh, and you have to tell them about tomorrow a little bit. Like, you, you haven't told them nothing. Did that make me fake? Mm hmm. It does. Girl, let me come but I have my uh, statistics class. Uh, we went over something new again. He said that on on Wednesday of next week. Today is Wednesday, so I like we have them on Mondays and Wednesdays, so. I guess not next class, but the class after that we have a test again. Everybody was complaining, but honestly, I don't mind because like overall I have an 82 in his class. I want an A, so just go on and give us more. <laughs> go on and give us another one so I could try to get an A on this one. Um, but yeah, and it's just like I've been missing a mark just by a little bit in his class. Like I got an 80 on one, then an 85 on the other one. I'm like, God damn, I just want 100 on one so that we can just kind of average it out to about a 90. But um, I had that. Then I went to the coffee shop. I showed y'all some clips of that. I just got breakfast when I was there. I haven't got breakfast uh, from there in a while. So, got breakfast from there. And then I went to, uh, went to drop off the shirts. And then now, I came home. I took a little nap because I wasn't feeling well. Um, I still don't feel like 100%, but it's much, much better now. About to make me a little matcha. Got my little situation right here. I want to show y'all. Because I should have had another drink the other day. So this is my second drink. My oh, second yeah. type of drink. Um, Y'all knew was like good. It, it tastes just like a cookie. Mm. Because the cookie dough creamer is not chocolate cookie dough. Right. If that makes sense. It's just cookie dough. So the, uh, oh, your back. Yeah, like that. Yeah, my shit. Yeah, nah, I feel you. Especially because that uh, stool don't have no back. But um, since the cr the other creamer was cookie dough, but the actual coffee is mocha, it seemed... It tastes just like a chocolate chip cookie without being oh, too chocolatey. Too chocolate, that yeah. Ooh, so I'm like, yeah, that could be good. It probably could be good with the matcha too, but I, I, I don't know. I'm already not feeling Maybe well. Not, not today. <laughs> not today. <laughs> but this is white chocolate raspberry with matcha. This is the Chiavani creamer again. I got them from Publix. That one went free. And then this matcha makes people say uh, not to drink pre-made matcha. I, I'm going to drink what I want to drink. And that's just that. And I'm going to finish up this watermelon. My chocolate croissants that I be getting from Publix. That's my little snack for right now. <laughs> like that's my little snack. Way. Like, oh my goodness. And I think feel like I'm hungry too. Maybe that's playing into like the headache. Yeah, yeah. You I'm like a headache on top of. But I, I got a sausage, egg, and cheese sandwich from Jasmine too. It was good. I had a um, couple weeks ago, I had that on French toast. Like when they were French toast. Mm -hmm. that was good. They didn't have the French toast. They had the. English muffin or the croissant today. Oh, okay. I'm gonna have to pull this little lash off because they ain't gonna bother me. Now tell them all your business. So, Maria, Miss Aries herself, birthday is in about three weeks. Mm -hmm. So, she got her birthday photo shoot tomorrow. I do. And she has a whole little concept going, and it's gonna be so cute. Yeah. And so, so, just so special. 21 is so special, and it's gonna be special. And now tell them about all this work you got you doing right now. I really, okay, so it's a busy weekend or week for her too because my best friend is coming uh, yeah. on tomorrow night. And so we're going to just be going out and having fun because it's pretty great. And so I'm just trying to get ahead of my work. But tomorrow is the photo shoot. So it's just like, you know, a lot of yeah. people this day is like the prep for the photo shoot. Like, so that's what I'm out here doing, just getting my work done. It's going good. I just, you know, mm -hmm. it's ready to be done. But that's real for nothing. We'll get it all done yeah. now. But you know, sometimes your teacher don't open a stamina up until the days do, and I got a couple. Yep. Of so mm -hmm. I'm just do what I can. Right. No, I feel like. I do not like to drink too much of this. I've been thinking I'm putting too little in my cup, but I feel like I don't like to drink too much. Hmm. A creamy drink. You don't. <laughs> you, know, you well, except eggnog. You 
you you with the dead stuff. Back here, your stomach. Yeah, was stuff stuff. Is gonna get mad. Oh, so, yeah. remember that day? Was it? Was it this? Was it this past time we had to finish the eggnog? We had to finish. Like, oh yeah. We, just had to finish the <laughs> we were leaving it for like break. So we already had, we had got like a bunch. Y'all was probably on here. Yes. We had uh, got a bunch of snacks. Cause we was like, oh, we not gonna see each other for a little bit. Let's get our snacks. Let's have a movie night. We got some eggnog, and we really had to like chug it was gonna expire, the whole bottle. Yeah, it was gonna expire, so we wasn't trying to waste it. So we drank it up. And I said it wasn't too bad, was it? But no, that shit was cool. eggnog is so rich though. Like that be the problem. No, it is, but it's just so like you gonna get full. And don't let you add no whipped cream to it. Oh, that, that might be a bit much. Mm -hmm. But you gonna add whipped cream. Mm -hmm. You have to. You are kind of making a mess. Yeah, it's good. It was better yesterday, but that's because this expires today. Today? Mm -hmm. Okay. I can't just. Bro, did I get this yesterday? Um, no. No, you got the day off with you. Yes. Yeah, I got this other day. But it was better than whatever day I had it because I guess now since it's getting close to that date. But you said you can't just eat watermelon? Watermelon no. just gives me. As somebody else that I like cutting up and all that, yeah, I have to really be in the mood for it. I feel like so, um, I feel like if it's not in season, it can be not it. But yeah. like it's springtime, summertime. I feel like that's when they get in season. It's nice and juicy. It's giving me like playing in the backyard. That's why I like it. Playing in the backyard for sure. Yes, it definitely gives that. So, but we used to. I don't know if I really used to have them in dice slices growing up. We used to just have to. The um, I just started liking watermelon like in 2023. So uh, growing up though, they used to like cut the, up yeah. They used to you know. Yeah. No parents don't be feeling like it. They gonna yeah, slice it up, up and y'all gonna take it. Yeah. And we used to <laughs> then it's like as a kid, you eat it, it's messy. you face deep in it, it's running down oh, your damn yeah. elbows, yeah. and your face kind of sticky, and then the bees. <laughs> don't let you be outside with the oil and the hose because you gotta crunch your thirst after eating all that fruit. You do. <laughs> you do. <laughs> Just so bad. Oh, but um yeah so i'm probably not gonna check in no more today because i just really want to focus on like getting together the stuff that i mentioned earlier that i needed to do then i also want to focus on um just getting better I, overall because maria photo shoot is tomorrow we got stuff to do oh, you're gonna love the makeup look that i think okay cool maria wants me to do her makeup that as well like and i've done maria's makeup when i was toe up before and baby oh my god the hands the trembling hands. i couldn't focus um, Y'all, they was probably on here for that too. See, this is why I like to vlog because that's another reason. Like, yeah, they like, were on here. Well, this Y'all can your birthday vlog. Like, yeah, my birthday last year. Uh huh. Her uh -huh. birthday yeah. last year. We had got toe up the night before. We had no idea. And yeah. <laughs> yeah. I remember yeah. the picture of me on the couch with my legs. You know, I didn't you know, post that one, y'all. Uh uh. Let me show you. That's like close friends. It, it will see only. if it's close material. We will I, see. I don't want nobody screenshot my stuff. <laughs> but we had uh, got towed up the night before. We had, where did we go, friend? We was in, like, we brought my birthday in here. Oh, like, yeah, we, we brought it in like, here. Food. Yep, okay, now I remember. I remember that, yep. And then we was upstairs, like, on the little. Yeah, it's the back, like, the patio, the, I guess. I don't know. This is on. Um, Let me see. Where is it? Okay, oh, no, not. Where is it? Like it was just so. Oh yeah. Cool. Like, it know. was crazy. Like Gio and Deli had to bring us to the room. <laughs> it gets worse. <laughs> but Gio and Deli had to bring us to the room, and they was telling me like, I mind y'all, y'all know our nights now. <laughs> I be, I, I be the, I be the, I be the problem. Yeah. I be the problem at the end of the night. But they said Maria was the problem. <laughs> And that is forever funny to me no, because like, I know I be tweaking. So I'm like, if they say Maria was the worst one, and she's usually like the level-headed one, even when we drunk, like you still able to like lock yes. in when you need to lock in. But like no, that's like the one time <laughs> I can genuinely say I like I don't remember a lot of the stuff. That, that is so so no. so funny. That was so bad. Like that is so funny to me. But anyway, the next day we got the nerve to be trying to go to dinner yes. and get dressed and get cute and all that. I was on the shuttle so nauseous. Oh like, my oh god! Because I remember I had to leave your house yes. that morning because this is when I still lived on campus. Right. So I had left from with her and I went back to my room where I was so fucking miserable with that roommate. Oh my god! Oh my god! I'm 
so bad. Uh, Maria wants me to do a story time on that so bad. Y'all, yeah, I can't. Wouldn't even like. Y'all, I can't because I'm like, honestly, like, I am very, y'all know, like, I show my real self on here like 110%. Would you agree, Fred? Like, yeah. I feel like I show my real self on here 110%. But, like, when I get, like, <laughs> When it's certain stuff that like really blows me or like pisses me off, can, can, I'm not going to talk about it. Yeah. That I'm not going to talk about it in a politically correct way. Like, I'm a Sagittarius through and so, through. So, long story short, <laughs> she's going to end up getting canceled. Yeah. And so, y'all going to be like, oh my God, like, that was me. And it's like, <laughs> honestly, like, if, if something is really, like, that, that's just how I am. And if y'all know a Sagittarius in y'all life, then... Every Sagittarius in my life act just like this. Yeah, and I really try not to put shit on zodiac signs, but like but this no, is just a fact of the Sagittarius I know. Like this is just a fact. So even ones that I don't know personally, like yeah. celebrity Sagittarius, I'm like, yeah, yeah, that's that was how they act. Like unhinged stuff, <laughs> but basically, yeah, it was a lot. But anyway, I remember we was in a room and I was doing her makeup and my hand was just shaking and she was just like, oh. yeah, yes, she yes. couldn't keep her eyes closed. Yeah, that's when you wanted the eyeliner and stuff. Yeah. I'm like, oh my gosh, you wanted like this graphic eyeliner, and then we just trying to put the lashes. We was like, oh we did. my we god. We couldn't put the lashes on in the room. Couldn't put the lashes on in the room. Short on time. Short on time. It was just so much. Oh, it was so so much, and we was just like, wow, how can we do this? No regrets. But no regrets. You, ten out of ten. When you when left, uh, looking like you had came from like. Oh, right. Like, when I left her house the next morning to go had, back. Yes, I was, was crazy. Crazy. <laughs> I was holding a box of pizzas. I forgot Some what shoes, shoes I had on. The I'm boots. holding my heels. She had her, her heels. I'm yes. holding my heel boots. Probably a jacket. Makeup not completely washed off, so I'm looking kind of crazy. Right. I had a little jacket. Yeah, because remember I wore that yes. green, jacket. green jacket. So I had that jacket. I had the shorts. I think and you might have had on my shirt. I had on like, her shirt. So much. Like. I, I think I had on your pants as well. <laughs> And I'm just going home looking like I just came from like whatever. Like it just looks crazy. Oh my god. But yeah, no. But this year, add it to the list. Just add it to the list. Um, but yeah, gonna eat my snacks. Probably watch my show and just chill out. I'm trying to focus on feeling better. I do feel a little better already. But when I eat this, I'm gonna take ibuprofen because I guess you can't take that without eating. Yeah. And I hadn't ate since this morning like that was hours ago so yeah talk to y'all probably tomorrow because tomorrow's an eventful day so you know and we're just gonna take y'all with us absolutely good morning y'all so i know we last left off yesterday when i was telling y'all that i needed to recover and feel better but i feel 100 percent better now like i knew it wasn't nothing major it was just the fact that i needed to kind of blow my nose a lot yesterday and take the ibuprofen after that i was pretty good um i spent my night just chilling watching my show I can't even really remember much from yesterday, really. I was just chilling, and I was able to sleep in today because my classes are canceled for today. So I don't have anything to do um, related to, like, leaving the room, going to class. So I didn't have to get up early, which was a plus. Um, it's currently 12.20 right now. I did my morning routine. I'm actually recording a day in a live video today for um, TikTok, YouTube shorts, Instagram reels, that type of short-form content. So make sure y'all go check that out. But um, I was recording that this morning. Other than that, I haven't did anything major. Um, I still need to film my outfit clip for whenever I get dressed. Because I told y'all I'm doing that every day this week. Well, every weekday this week. And then um, I want to edit the vlog before this. I haven't had time to do that because it was spring break. And during spring break, I was at home chilling, having a good time. Like, literally, I was only home for a week. So, or a little less than a week. No, that was a full week. So I was home for a full week, um, and almost every day I was doing something like with my siblings, with my mama, with my boyfriend, with my friend. You know, like, I was always doing something, so I didn't really have time to sit down and edit, which was a plus because I kind of needed a week where I was just relaxing, resetting. I kind of used spring break to do that, um, and I'm glad, no regrets, but still that um, episode 12 does still need to get edited. It doesn't have to go up till Sunday. Today is Thursday, but I want to get at least started on editing it today. I probably won't finish it today because I don't necessarily need to. Usually I try to have my blogs finished editing by Saturday so they can upload and then I have time to kind of like, I guess, promote it, market it or whatever. And then the following day is when it will usually be uploaded. So I'm not in a rush to do that, 
but the weather's nice i feel like i might um sit outside and do that i actually could go for a walk too if i have time today but i don't necessarily need to go for a walk because when every time i go for a walk i find myself in that coffee shop down the street getting a chai latte or getting something and i don't need that because i have all my stuff that i use to make my drinks y'all know what i use to make my matcha now and then my iced coffees i don't always get that chocolate coffee but still something in there but i don't know how to make a chai so let me think I might go get one today we'll see if not today then I might allow myself to go maybe tomorrow or Saturday we will see um because I haven't been able to go to the gym and my hair I'm not sweating my hair out this week so I'll be in the gym starting Monday anywho um so I had to edit that vlog told myself I'll probably sit on the balcony or maybe upstairs on the patio I don't know just outside so I can get some air while I um some fresh morning air while I edit um, and then I have to do one assignment for my social psych class, one assignment for my sociological theory class. I don't necessarily have to do either of them. Well, I have to do one of them because it's due by Sunday. But the other one I don't have to do because it's not due till Monday. But I'm going to try to get it done today as well because uh, we're supposed to be going out tomorrow. Today will probably be a late day. And then um, today will probably be a late day. And oh. My work schedule for this week is pretty light, but my work schedule for next week isn't. So I feel like I, whatever you got to do, just get it done today. You know, they say don't put off for tomorrow what you can do today. So if I can do the assignments now, have free time, I'm going to get them out the way. Because I don't want next week to be stressful if I can help it, you know. And then aside from school stuff or my to-do list, uh, Maria's photo shoot for her birthday is also today. So I have to do her makeup um, a little bit later. The shoot is until 7. So we have some time. I'll probably start her makeup around like 4 or 5. Um, but in the meantime, I have about like four hours where I can get those assignments done, try to edit this vlog a little bit and just kind of like have a slower day considering that I don't have, um, I don't have to leave the room until later today, but that's pretty much what my day consists of. Let's get into it. You will find everything. Just so thankful for all of you. I'm so thankful for the village community. So listen, I have a... Um, I got a question on YouTube from another episode that we put out. place Maria is about to do her shoot right now we was running y'all we just had so much it was my fault no it's not your fault we just town wasn't on our side that's all that means but we finna get into it she got about 30 minutes to shoot yeah. um and my girl is photogenic so i told her we don't even need to worry uh, i want you naked in here no worries at all basically I'll she gotta get dressed my, um, tights first. okay so oh, yeah. yeah we um I had to do her makeup. Oh, when, when they see like the full makeup, they're gonna love yes. it. Yes, and I, I'm basically I'm not gonna show her too much, y'all, because I want y'all to be surprised. So April 11, go to Marie page now, you. and you'll see. But of course, I'm gonna post another vlog before the end. So I'm saying I'm gonna post her birthday vlog. So y'all, y'all be reminded again to go to her page closer to time. But. Yeah, we was ripping and running, child. We kicking it no, with our Uber driver. At least he was running. cool. Uh, he was I'm so finishing cool. up her makeup in the car. And he just talking to us. Yeah, really he was. He was cool. Yeah. And it helped calm my nerves a little bit. No, that helps me. Yes. But, yeah, basically we about to shoot. We got everything all set up. We're ready. This is, if y'all remember, this is the same photographer from my birthday. Okay, so, so everything is pretty smooth from here because we you know come to we already know how it's gonna go now all that so talk to y'all after the shoot 
So we're back from the shoot. The shoot was a success. She was able to get some really good shots. And I was recording that behind the scenes content for her. So I think she don't like the pictures a lot. Um, we went to Jersey Mike's afterwards because we're starving. Like the shoot was at 7. So that's usually around the time that I eat. And we didn't get back here till about 9. Jersey Mike's was closed. We just want to go there. We end up going to Cabo. I got me a pita sandwich. I usually just get the um, hot honey harissa chicken and then i'll just switch up the toppings that i get sometimes i got like the super greens the red pepper hummus the tzatziki sauce the crazy feta it's a bunch of stuff on here it looked really good i was surprised that they had all the ingredients because that kind would be um saying they don't have stuff and then i got my ice creams if y'all watched the last episode the last vlog you know that i was raving about these they're so good i left one in the freezer for maria to try when i went home for spring break and she said it was so good so me and her once we picked this up we was like let's go to um to Publix and see if they um got the disc off ice cream because last time i went there they was out of stock and they had them so i'm so excited it's literally so good like you would think these are too sweet since it's like cookie butter in it and it's uh like a belgian white chocolate um, it got like the cookies on it and all that, but like Biscoff cookies are not even sweet on their own. So they're sweet, but like not crazy sweet. This is a 10 out of 10. And then I also got me a, um, a Olipop, the cherry vanilla, which is, I think this is my favorite kind. <coughs> Haven't tried them all, but so far that's my favorite kind. So I'm about to watch Desperate Housewives and eat. I do have a assignment that I want to do before bed. But I'm going to do it off camera, of course, because nothing to really show other than that. Um, today was a successful day. I'm so real, though. Like, where did the time go today? I feel like today went by so quick, and I really didn't get anything significant done except doing her makeup. But, I mean, it's whatever. Um, that shot was just so perfect. I'm just going to really just eat and chill out for the rest of the night. And I'll talk to y'all tomorrow. Tomorrow we're supposed to be going out. Um, and I'm gonna take pictures tomorrow fingers crossed that they turn out the way I want because I'm kind of over this hair already But I just talked to y'all tomorrow. Tomorrow should be an eventful day. Today is Friday. Um, we're supposed to be going out later We're still going out. Um, we're about to start getting ready in a, like a, a few hours But I wanted to come on here because I know I haven't checked in with y'all today. I slept in y'all I didn't wake up till I don't know what time but I know it was an afternoon um I was up late already, but then uh, Diamond landed last night, so they came here. We just talked for hours. I didn't realize how long we was talking. It was like five something, maybe six when I went to sleep. So I slept in. Plus, it's raining outside. It's like cloudy and all that. The weather today is not going to be good at all, but we still going to go out. We still going to have a good time. Um, right now, I'm doing this assignment because I wanted to get this last assignment done. You know, you party harder when all that schoolwork is done. So I'm doing this. Um, once I do this assignment, I really ain't going to have anything due until Thursday. I think it's Wednesday or Thursday. But it's just my literature review for my social psych class. But I can work on that, you know, a little bit every day this week. I don't have to rush or feel like I'm not going to be able to finish it in time or not get a good grade. So I'm finishing this up. And then afterwards, I'm going to start, you know, figuring out what time we're going to be leaving out. Because I'll start getting dressed after a while. I want to take pictures today and stuff like that. Y'all, I've been sitting in here. My sister been telling me every single day to watch that Quiet on the Set um, Nickelodeon documentary stuff. So I went ahead and watched that. It's on HBO Max and I think it's on Hulu too, but I watched it on HBO Max. Anyway, y'all, that shit is sick as hell. Like, I was watching it a little bit yesterday and we kind of was talking about that last night when it came in here. I had to cut that off before I went to sleep. I was like, that's not going to be the last thing I watch before I go to bed. It's just not. Um, so I finished watching it this afternoon child uh-uh they just left a bad taste in my mouth like i just can't even deal so i don't know i'm finna uh finish this up i'm watching like the youtube interview that tebow off i probably did him i don't know why he interviewed him but he did an interview on him so i'm watching that right now i got like 15 minutes left and then by the time i'm hoping that by the time i'm done with this i should be done with this assignment too and then i can just get a move on with my day because i'm actually ready to get dressed i'm excited to take pictures get content and stuff like that so I'll talk to y'all once i you know really get a start on the day start getting ready really a start on the night okay <laughs> Yeah, yeah. Roll, yeah, yeah. Now, 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 now. If they want me, hey, 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 hey. If they want me, hey, 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 hey. If they want me, hey, 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 hey. If they want me, hey, hey, hey,
motherfucking thing. I ain't gotta do the motherfucking thing, bitch. <laughs> Hey homegirls, I'm fully dressed. I forgot to check in with y'all. This is the finished makeup. Get into it, get into it. That's a pay actor. The Evelyn Cyrus is a pay actor. But this is the makeup. Redid my edges, whatever. Silver jewelry. This is the top. Little tees, little tees. These are the pins. Can y'all see it? And they like unzip in the back. Y'all don't have to see on Instagram. Um, and then let me show you the shoes. We're in the parking garage taking pictures. That's blocking it. Get into the look. These are my shoes. That's basically it. I'm trying to get good pictures. So far, I'm not liking my pictures. But I'm gonna keep making it do what it do. And hopefully, I can like them. Huh? Y'all, some security man right here. Maria. But, is it gonna be? Hmm. Oh. Anyway, y'all, I got distracted because I seen the security man. But anyway, we finna finish taking our pictures. And then we'll head out soon. That light is blocking it. But I think I might take my pictures over there because in the elevator, it wasn't given. The damn light is kind of like how this light being with the camera. It was all in my face. I didn't like it at all. And the face card and everything, it just wasn't given what it's given on this monitor right now. And what it was given when I was looking in the mirror. All right, now. Nah. So hopefully my pictures turn out good because I feel like I look good and I feel good. And I want my pictures to reflect that. Gordon. Okay, period. I'm taking my pictures, y'all. Show them you, Diamond. You can turn it around. Okay. Let me show y'all Diamond. Get into Diamond. Okay, okay. Show them the full outfit. Okay. Maria, you didn't show them your outfit today. What's up? Yes. Hey, Get into my friend. Oh. Okay. Yeah. Okay. I'm looking at them, and I was just thinking that. But I was like, I'm gonna get into it. Yeah, this eat. Okay, y'all, so we walk into the the place we finna go, I guess like a lounge or whatever. This is, I already showed John Murray and Diamond. But we walking through here. Figuring it out. Yeah, trying to figure it out. My pants that he falling, y'all, this don't give. <laughs> I do. Uh, y'all, is this back outside? No. Okay. Cause it's just like, come on now. Driving it is Damn, man. So it's probably back outside, but then you like. Okay. Ugh. Yikes on the bike. Yikes on the what? On the bike. Oh. Ugh. Okay, let me fix my face. Let me fix it. I'm going to. I'm just making faces. Fix your face. We acting bougie. What's this? Kenny? No, they got some. I think we we got it. Hey. Oh, you said how we doing or do we know we going? Uh-uh. No. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> oh, there you go. Get the fuck out of here. We asked anything. But you go. 
Jump on us! No, they ran. Bitch, they been not. Uh, they bet the fuck not. I'm not playing. They that ran past my feet. Oh. Yeah, like, hey, who girls? It's the next day. We had a ball last night. We really had a good time. We got in pretty late last night. I showered and went straight to bed, so I didn't check in. But it's the next day. I, I've been up for a while. I went to a grocery store. I got all my groceries for the week because I worked a couple days this week. So a couple days like back to back so I thought I wasn't gonna have time plus class it just wasn't gonna be time to go to the store so I went I got me some good groceries y'all so um, and I'm getting back into cooking so I'll be cooking dinner tomorrow some tacos but something better than nothing because I've been like just eating quick meals lately because I've been at work and then my off days be so spaced apart and I eat dinner at work it's just a long story but basically I'm excited to have my groceries and I'm gonna get ready to go to work in a couple hours. I'm just sitting in here chilling, watching Desperate Housewives per usual. But I just want to come on here and close out the vlog. Tell y'all, uh, thanks for watching. Like, comment, subscribe, share the video with your sister, brother, cousin, uncle. Follow me on Instagram, of course. Follow my TikTok, and I'll see y'all in the next episode. Bye.